Hey YouTube and welcome back to my channel. It's Dirty Dems aka Demo Graphics and today I'm going to be painting another dog portrait. So if you watched my previous video I painted a, a portrait of my dog Solar at the Melmania event. So it's only fair that I paint a portrait of my other dog. Um, this is not an event but it's in the centre of Norwich so Hopefully it will get seen. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna paint Luna today. She's a blue staff. So I'm gonna paint her on this wall behind me. I've got my first lines on the wall now. You can kind of see like a kind of holographic uh, ghost faint outline of Luna on there. Um, if you look carefully, I've used the background, which is the gums and tongues piece um, as my doodle grid. So that's my point of reference. I've taken a photo of the piece and then I've imposed the photorealistic picture that I'm painting on top using an app so I've made it transparent and I've now traced on my first line so now I'm going to start filling it in so this has saved me a bit of time I don't have to do any roller in I'm just going to spray straight over So a little update, got a lot of the base colours on, so I've dusted all my base colours, filling up this uh, wall nicely. Um, yeah, I'm probably going to have a break for lunch, so a little bite to eat, and then go have a wander and see what some of the other guys have been painting. So I've got it all blocked in. I found the pores quite tricky getting my head around the shading on the pores. But now I'm gonna start working in the details. So that's pretty much all the base color done. I'm gonna work from the top down. Hi YouTube, uh, because this video is quite short, I'm gonna throw in some clips of the progress on my garden. So I'm building a studio, so I'm doing the concrete pour today. So there'll be some concrete being laid down, pumped down, so it's a big day for me. Um, I've got some local help, so shout out Zyme. He's gonna be helping me with concrete pour, as so is my brother. And yeah, hopefully it all goes to plan. It's a bit nerve wracking, because I've not done it before. But I've got to the stage where I've compacted all the hardcore and the type one MOT, and I've put a uh, gridded rebar down 
so that will give the concrete some extra strength. And then uh, clear that area then yep. and get it all ready. Yeah. I got a little drone. Does it shoot out? I need something. So, I'll come out first and then obviously follow by the concrete. <laughs> there we go. There she blows. And we started. Jesus. blow the line through. Yeah. Um, once the ball's in, obviously you've got to be careful. Um, but I shall let you know, the tree don't stand anywhere near the end of the line. Yeah. Obviously it controls, but it goes wrong. So we might just get a little bit more out from the pipe. So we're just waiting for that right now. We've got all this area done so yeah we didn't get quite all the way to the end but we just buy a few bags of self mix and we'll just finish it off <laughs> Explosion. Four inch diameter pipe. So yeah. So you squish it down, just drags all the concrete out and it sort of gives it a bit of a clean as yeah. it doesn't go. Sponge ball so, cleaned it out. Yeah. I use a smaller one if I was taking it back and all of this. But yeah, yeah. no, it's brilliant. I need a new one. That one's about had it. Put it on the spray, might get some of the dust. <laughs> yeah, don't step back, bro. I'll turn. Yeah, thick and fast. Getting there with the the fur, so the fur effect is quite a long process because you've got to have the fur going in different directions so you've got to look at the picture closely to get the fur directions and I'm using a bit of cardboard to get that stenciled thin line and I'm just building up the fur. So I've done one half of the face and I've got, I'm working on the paw down here and then I'm going to move over to the other half of the face and do the other paw. 
Um, don't think I'm going to spend too much time on the background, but my main focus is the portrait. Now 5.30, everybody else has gone home, but I've managed to get the portrait finished. I've not really bothered too much on the background, it's just a bit abstract. I've focused mainly on the detail uh, just to get it finished. It's now 5.30, so yeah, it's been a long day. I know this video is gonna be short, but really it's just an insight into what I've been doing today and uh, a chance to show you some of the other artwork in Norwich. What's that? What's that? What's this? What's this? Hey, what's up, Luna? If you like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel peace